then we can go on and put any name that you like you can put tech design like me <laughs> or anything else that's just my youtube channel tech and design so that's what i usually use unfortunately we will have to set up a password i say unfortunately because i don't need one myself but we're just gonna leave it on right now later on we're just gonna take it out but keep in mind that you should keep this check mark here where it says allow my apple id to reset this password it's just in case you ever forget your password you can just use your apple id in order to reset it then on the bottom right hand corner again just click on continue on by the way you can change your full name account name to anything you would like then we're gonna see this icloud it's just gonna set up your account after just a little bit you're gonna see this you can always customize your settings on the left hand side however for now we're just gonna go into continue now this is your touch id touch id by the way it's also your power button so it's not just for touch id and that will be on the top right hand corner of your keyboard you're gonna see that so once again we're just gonna press on continue on and all we have to do is just any finger that you like, actually. Go ahead and hold it here. You're going to lift it up, hold it, 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 lift it up, and you're done. Now, you just do that again. Up, down, up, down. I'm not actually pressing on the button. I'm just placing my finger on top of it. Then press continue, and we're done with the touch ID. You can also set up Apple Pay. You don't have to, but we're just going to continue on. If you don't want to, you can press set up later. So that's going to be an option on your screen that you're going to see. Now, if you skipped Apple Pay or you didn't and you set it up, the next thing you will see is this. You're pretty much done with the setup right now. Just click on OK. So the first thing that you have to check is for updates on your Mac. On the top left hand side corner of your screen, you're going to see the Apple logo. Go into your second option where it says system settings. And then from here, just going to search and put in updates then it's going to check for any updates but and hopefully you are all up to date so right now it is as far as this video you're all done you're ready to go just remember the basics you can as can go on and use safari which is your basic web browser you can download google chrome if that's something that you like you don't need to purchase any apps from the app store you can definitely download programs into your mac that are not from the app store just in case and you can customize your mac to make it fit for you so you, there's a lot of stuff that you can do with it but that's another video that's the manual that i have for your macbook pro and or macbook air but as far as this video goes we are all done if you guys have any comments questions you guys can write down here in comments area don't forget to subscribe and like thank you